Kimberly Rochelle, from The Other Way Season 5 has been acting crazy lately, more than usual. The American is not only rude on the show, but also in real life. As a spiritual individual, you expect Kimberly to be a calm person, whose highest priority is to love herself and others around her, despite what life throws at her, however, she's only doing the love herself part, and failing miserably in dealing with the rest. Tejaswi's wife has already been cancelled, after her recent controversial comments, about Indian people and their bad odors. To destroy her public image even more, she recently threatened a 90-day fiancé fan with witchcraft, just because she saw a comment that she didn't like, under one of the videos from her YouTube channel. It's an unpleasant fact, that many of the show fans, are known for leaving nasty comments, either in the comments sections of 90 Day Fiancé fan pages, or directly under the cast members' social media posts. A fan watched one of Kimberly's YouTube videos, and decided to leave the following comment under it, and she said, I pray for this man mental health, having to deal with your crazy Karen self, Lord tell that man to run for his life. A sane person, whose life is under the microscope, would have ignored or deleted that comment, which was made by a random online stranger, but not Kimberly Rochelle. She got so triggered by what the show fan wrote, and she decided to clap back, and even threatened the woman with witchcraft. Kimberly's answer was, do you really think the best decision to do, is cyber bully someone, who you think is crazy and is into witchcraft and can distribute karma without lifting a finger? I'm legitimately curious. The reality TV cast member must be insane and delusional, to think that she can do anything with her finger to anyone. She claims to be a clairvoyant and also a psychic, and yet, she couldn't anticipate what was waiting for her in India, after getting married to TJ. Anyone who watched The Other Way Season 5 can conclude, that calling Kimberly crazy is what triggers her the most. The last time her husband called her that during a heated argument, she started to scream like a maniac after she told him, don't you dare calling me crazy. Since September 2023, Kimberly flew back to the United States without her Indian husband, and based on her social media activities, she's still there. No one can tell yet, whether the couple reconciled, after they finished filming for the tell-all episodes, or they split for good. Thank you for watching. Before you leave, don't forget to like this video and to subscribe to our YouTube channel for the latest 90 Day Fiancé news and gossips. Also, follow us on social media for the latest 90 Day Fiancé memes. Links are in the description below.